Hey everyone, Caramel here. Today we'll be looking at Super Hot on the PS5. How does it run? What's it like? Any problems? Uh, yes, this is a double upload this week because I didn't upload a video last week because I was having problems with Google Drive, which I need to transfer my footage between devices in order to make videos, and it wasn't working, so I wasn't able to make one last week. But I felt bad, so I thought I'd, I'd do a, uh, two videos this week. But I don't have time to make one on like a game that's like super in-depth and like has a lot to talk about I thought I'd just make a video on something quick like super hot so let's get into it the game runs in backwards compatibility mode on the PS5 and the resolution of the game on the PS5 is unknown because I don't know the resolution of the game on PS4 or PS4 Pro I cannot find any information about it on the internet I don't think like anyone knows what the resolution is at least I can't find anybody who does uh, I would guess that on the PS4 it runs at 1080p and if they updated it for the PS4 Pro, I would imagine it would be 4K. I know there is a PS4 Pro patch for the VR version of the game that increases the resolution. But I don't know about the normal version of the game. But I would guess 4K. Playing a game on PS5, it looks really sharp. It looks really clean and good. Uh, Anti-aliasing is really good. Um, it's 60 FPS across uh, PS4, PS4 Pro, and PS5. So all 60 FPS. The loading times don't seem to be improved as far as I can tell. Um, they're pretty fast across all platforms. Um, backwards compatibility mode is not able to tap into all of the PS5's new SSD. Only some of it. So if it was a native PS5 game, it would probably load faster. But it's not. But it still loads really fast. like Just like it did on PS4 and PS4 Pro. They all run really fast. So loading times are not an issue. I haven't played through the entire game yet, I'm pretty close to the end, but I have not noticed anything weird or you know, any visual bugs or glitches or any performance issues. It stays to that locked 60 FPS, doesn't budge at all. And overall, it is a really great way to play the game. So that's it for Super Hot. It's the same on PS5 as it is on PS4 Pro. Not really much to talk about, but I just thought I'd do a quick video on it. I double up with this week because I felt bad about missing last week. So if you liked the video, you found it useful, informative, entertaining in any way, maybe it impacted your decision on whether you want to buy or play the game on PS5, uh, leave a like, help support the channel, subscribe for more PS5 backwards compatibility reviews, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.